Hi, my name's Leslie Pike and I'm a professional glass engraver. I have been engraving glass since 1983. One of the most important things about glass engraving is being able to see it really clearly. The use of a good light is vitally important, especially as a lot of my engraving is done with water and so water dulls the engraving while you're working and you've got to be able to see it really clearly. In most cases the lighting needs to come from above and behind the glass vessel. You need to be able to manipulate the position and the height of the light. The whole idea of engraving is the more you rough up the surface of the glass the more light it will catch. So therefore if you are struggling to see it with it being wet and all the water's gone inside the engraving you need a good good light source and that will be picked up by the engraving. Not all desk lamps are easy to manipulate when it comes to positions and therefore when I found series readers uh, I was intrigued. Everything sounded absolutely right. Now I need to share with you uh, this incredible product. I um, have been sent a light, top of the range, desk lamp. It is still in its box and let me tell you when you get a box containing a desk lamp that is as big and as serious looking as this you know it's not an ordinary desk lamp. There we go. This arrives <laughs> all sorts of instructions on how to hold it, how to ship it this way up and lay me down to open. <laughs> so I am really really thrilled and very grateful to Serious Readers for sending this lamp to me to give it a go um, at an absolute professional level. It should help with my filming as well because lighting of course is vital in making videos and I've been making videos on YouTube since YouTube began. It's going to be so exciting. Right, so I have to lay this down and I will get back to you very shortly. So the first thing I see when I open the box is numbers and here we have this little box inside with step one. Open here. On opening the first box we have not just a leaflet, we have a welcome pack. Okay, there we go. Welcome pack, personalized, name on it, a time, a place, a book, relax. Well, I won't be necessarily relaxing because I'm using this for hard work. So it opens up and in here we have high definition instructions, a welcome from the founder and then very good very clear drawings and instructions on how to use it, how to set it up, getting started, safety, standby mode, snooze function, dimmer, memory, uh, beam width adjustment, that could be incredibly useful when it comes to filming because often with my lights you know I've, I've never been able to adjust them in any way shape or form and to be honest I have to put black material around anything around the edges that might brighten up because sometimes my camera wants to then pick up uh, and change the light according to the background or what it sees on the side and so I cover everything around in black but if I've got a light beam that is more focused that could change. I'm so excited about this. So beam width adjustment, changing the driver plug, driver plug? Changing the light engine? Wow, okay I think I better read this. I love it, I love a good gadget. Okay so um, five year uh, warranty, free five year warranty. You even get a nice bookmark for your reading experience. There's a few more facts and figures going on there. Right so that is an amazing welcome pack um, and quite unexpected for 
a desk lamp. Boxes two and three inside the main box are first of all the plug so that is attached already to box number three which is this very very heavy light. I had um, mentioned when they offered to send me a light the fact that because I am working with glass and I need a very sturdy base in order to be able to manipulate that light and it not wanting to fall over onto my glass they sent me a model with the heavy base and let me tell you this base that is, that is seriously heavy and that's not going to fall anywhere so it comes up all folded up and there is the light with this really strong stiff uh, neck. I am going to read the instructions first now before I go on to the next part of my video. Right here we have our light all set up and looking fantastic. I'm really impressed. The instructions were incredibly simple and easy to understand. Okay, um, as you can see the the neck very easy to manipulate up and down. This is your your little swivel section here just, just go all the way up to the top and all the way around the other way as well. It also can swivel up and all the way down. So as you can see, very, very easy to manipulate into different positions. Okay, there is a little uh, switch underneath, which perhaps I can show you. There it is. And I'm just going to press that and hey, presto, there we have light. Okay. There is a, a dial here which adjusts the beam. So I'm just going to turn this up slightly and I'll put this piece of cardboard here. And you can see how it changes the beam. Right, also uh, on the back, don't look at it, it's very very bright. On the back you will see a little wheel and when you turn that you will notice the little lights come on and this is changing its brightness so that's full strength bright and that is taking it all the way down to the lowest brightness okay very very useful quite amazing well I've got to say I am very impressed and now I am going to try it on the glass. My light is in position now um, over my desk and over the glass, which you'll see in a moment. You can see the dust extractor there, which is sucking it up as I am producing it. I'm engraving with a large diamond onto the glass. And you can see very clearly it's a beautiful light. It's not yellow. It's really rather impressive. You can see almost every speckle of dust. Here I am working with water and water as I mentioned earlier goes into the engraving and you can see that it is slightly duller but I can see very clearly what is going on with the light coming down. With the light turned off, you can hardly see it. It's very, very difficult to pick out any details and certainly for working. So on goes the light and while it is still wet, it's very clear. Drying that off, of course, it comes up bright and white. A light source like this, absolutely essential for glass engraving. Thank you, serious readers. I am thrilled to bits with my light.